Hello everybody, my name is Nick and you're watching the game. And we are going to continue our Terraria Let's Play series. Let's go right into this. Um, I'm really tired. It's like 8, which isn't super late, but I try to go to bed at around 9.30 or 10 p.m. So, pretty tired. Also, probably dehydration. Um, I got an achievement uh, recorded and there was audio issues, but I got an achievement called Fashion Statement, I believe it was called. Uh, it's just from equipping, fully equipping your vanity slots. Pretty easy to do. Today, I got no clue what we're doing. What can we do? Oh, we could do that. If I don't, okay, let me see if I have anything else going on. Um, I'm gonna be talking about Spider-Man a lot. Spider-Man 2 came out. And, wow. It is amazing, dude. I love Spider-Man 2. It is so, so good. Unbelievably amazing. There's been there's been a lot of great games. Amazing contenders for game of the year this year. Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. I've heard Baldur's Gate 3 is probably up there. Spider-Man 2, definitely up there. Um uh, if you have any other games that I didn't mention, because this is the big three I'm hearing, but I'd love to hear some uh, different games that haven't been mentioned by a lot of people yet. Um, oh, oh, I have a very, very big brain idea. Yeah, Clay, I'll, I'll clown Clay as a building block. Um, I think I saw something else. Snow. Sure, I'll count that. Why not? Um, another lens. If you're wondering what I'm doing, let's just say I'm going to get rich fast. Really, really fast. Um,. So yeah, Spider-Man 2. Um, I'll try to not do spoilers. I'll talk about what has been seen throughout trailers. How about that? So, I'm sorry, but if you don't want to be spoiled at all and you don't have the game yet, ah, you're a little bit out of luck, man. I'm terribly sorry. I'm going to be talking about it. I got it. It's amazing. And I really just cannot contain myself on that, man. It's an amazing game. How can I not talk about it, dude? Okay, so, um, symbiote suit? Excuse me? Um, that is, it's, it's amazing. It's so cool. I have it. Um, I won't tell you where you get it. I kind of, I mean, granted, I just, I did ask my friends, like, hey, am I kind of close to getting it? Yeah, okay. And then, um, we were just, you know, using my brain and looking at the thumbnails of Jacksepticeye series and watching the videos. I was like, okay, yeah, I'm definitely about to get it. Yeah, the mission I did, I did get the symbiote suit with the symbiote powers. Um, and it is absolutely amazing. I love it so much. Oh, pretty, probably useful. Um, it is just, nah. Just fabuloso. Pretty sure that's how you say it in Spanish. It's it's just amazing. The game is amazing, first of all, and the symbiote suit is amazing er, dude. Like oh. oh you need that to make that. Wait, what did I see with this then? What was I looking at? Oh the coat. Uh, I looks like we're living in the Midwest, boys, because we're gonna go deer hunting. That was a really cr 
cringy joke that only a select people will understand, probably. Not from the Midwest either, I'm from California, so... Ha <laughs> Okay, well anyways... Oh, I actually want to get this sickle, too. So let's just put the pinwheel, um... I don't really know. Uh, let's just put it right here, for now. Yeah, there you go. Very windy. So this sickle is actually very useful. So if you use the sickle, you actually get hay from long grass. Hay is a very interesting building block. I swear that was a slime. I did not kill the bunny, I swear, dude. That was a slime, okay? Um, but yeah, hay is a very cool building block. I've used it before, you know. Yeah, like any other building block, just looks cool. Um, so yeah, if you're into building, like me, uh, definitely get, get some hay. And, you know, you get a cool little sickle, so I mean, that's kind of cool, right? Uh, let's just put this sickle down, and trash this day bloom, and put the hay in the chest, and then... Oh, actually, hold up. Oh, uh, we are gonna have to fight the eye. Okay, so we're gonna have to... I go eye hunting. Sounds like a new Apple product, the eye hunt. Um, the corruption is this way, right? I don't actually know which way it's closer to. Oh wait, I have the pylon now. I guess technically it's closer both ways. It doesn't matter, it's the pylon. Okay. Okay, so Spider-Man suit. The symbiote suit is awesome, dude. It looks practically identical to how it does in the comics. You know, it's just 3D, has a texture, looks all slimy. But, I mean, I keep forgetting to use the thing. It's, it's here, right? Oh, no, 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 it's over here. The thing's over here, yep. Yep, okay. Um... But it looks exactly how the old one does in the comics, so that's freaking awesome, dude. Um, but yeah, I love the symbio suit. I think it looks so cool. So cool. Um, and the powers that you get with it are also really, really awesome. Oh my god, it literally just divides. I've never really seen that before, that's pretty funny. Uh, I'm just trying to look for a- oh wait, I don't have to worry about fall damage anymore. Nice. Oh my god, my back's so already hurting. I'm 15, why am I experiencing problems of a 30 year old? Uh, there we go. I'm gonna craft- let's see, how many do I have? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna leave that many left. So we're gonna fight five eyeballs. Obviously you can only fight at night time, so we're just gonna rest in the bed, catch some Z's, and remember to drink water. This is a water break. Eight minutes and 35 seconds into the episode. Ah. Yeah, make sure to drink some water. Um, so anyways. The powers, not even just from the Venom suit, Symbio suit, the powers in the game, awesome, it's so cool. Um, you know, the story of the game is super duper interesting, um, playing as both Miles and Peter is awesome, I mean, why wouldn't it be awesome, you know? But just the game as a whole is amazing, it feels so refined. So polished. Amazing game. Uh, that said, let's fight a giant eyeball five times. See how fast we can kill this thing. Look how powerful we are now. Oh, and then we don't have to worry about fall damage, so that's really, really nice. Oh, let's use this aqua scepter and do this quickly. Yeah, this is this is easy. I'm mainly just doing this for the demon eye ore and then the moolah. La. Yeah, I don't know where I was going with that one. You know what I'm trying to say? 
the money. Los dólares, el dinero. Dough, the bacon, the bread. Um, what are other things that people call money? Alright, first I defeated. Be cool to see what else we can get from it too, you know, any of the rare drops. Oh, I'm just, you know, pouring water on this eyeball. This is, this is, this is a very, um, accurate representation of how my life was. When I was younger, I used to have to take eye drops, and this is exactly how my life was. It just felt like a giant, like, not okay, it just felt like a giant drop of water was landing on my eye and cursing me and hurting. Because it sucked, I hated taking eye drops, I don't really remember why I had to in the first place. All I remember is that I had to, and it sucked, man. I hated it so much. No, I just hate eye drops now because of that. So, does my village village? <laughs> I tried to say villain villain and origin story at the same time, and I came with villagin. That's the new Minecraft mob, dude. The villagin. It's my favorite Minecraft mob. Uh, we're we've been wrecking, wrecking God. Uh, we've been wrecking shop on this eyeball for a while now, though. Um. So this is nothing too new for us, you know. Then we just go like that when he's in that phase, or, you know, in that part. Uh, before ah, oh, dang. Nice, there you go. And we got another mask. How how many masks have we gotten from him? I think this is the third one. Jeez. Um, what else about Spider-Man 2? It feels so fluid, it feels amazing. Um, no, I can't stop talking about the symbiote suit, but I mean, can you blame me? It's so cool. I've actually been drawing symbiote Spider-Man. Um, and I think it's been going pretty well, to be honest. I think I'm pretty good at drawing the symbiote suit Spider-Man. Come on, okay, there we go, there we go. This is where the big damage gets in. All of this right there, yep, 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 yep. And then we just hit him with this. We'll do some dummy Braxton damage, dude. A oh, comment below, if, you know, if you're a Spider-Man fan. Um, what your favorite suit is? Mine, mine is definitely, you know, the OG. Can never go wrong with that. And the symbiote suit. It's just so slick. It's so cool. Peter becomes like evil, you know. It's just awesome. And not from the game, I mean, just in general. Can never go wrong with the original and the symbiote suit is awesome especially from the ultimate universe dude where it's purple and venom's purple in that universe too like that is sick dude there's this few things that bring me joy like seeing the symbiote suit dude you know, there's things that bring me more joy, like my cats, but there's few things that bring me that amount of joy in that very oddly specific way. I can't believe we got the mask again, dude. Not, not the, oh, I got the trophy once already, okay, but like nothing else, you know. Actually, I don't think there can be anything else. I think for this boss, it's just the trophy and the mask, so. And what are you gonna do? Um. Now we can go to a demon altar though, so let's go do that. No, I'm, I'm, there you go. There you go. When you have max mana, fallen stars are just annoying. You can sell them though. So I guess that's the only good good thing about them after you get all all your mana. Sell them. And uh, to be honest, it's kind of the only thing to do with them because... I mean, you know, you could... This magic use, this use is for them for all classes, but I don't know, I just typically find them useless. Ah, I was, my, my day's been a little stressful since I got home, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so, I kinda screwed myself over, I didn't pay attention at all in math class today. And, uh, the work we had was literally what we were learning in math class. Yay, I'm so lucky. 
Ah, uh, that's not even luck bro, it's just my fault. I should have paid attention to be honest, but I was, you know, busy drunk Spider-Man and then um listen to music, so I mean Yeah, like I said, that's on me, that's on me. But um it's fine, I have friends who are actually smart and they told me how to do it. Um so we're all good. We're all good. Um but I you know I still had to finish that for homework, so you know I did. Um we're gonna be rich because of this. Let me make this into bars real quick, and we're gonna be rolling in cash, my guy. Um, yeah, so I had that, and then, actually, no, I think I finished that in history class, which is my fifth period class. Um, I had some geology homework to do, and there was this part, the last question where she wanted us to do something. It's kind of geology slash earth science, like, it's not really just geology. We're learning about, like, earthquakes right now. So, there's, there's two variants. That's the lamp. It's the lantern. Oh, maybe that one counts as. No, it is. Huh, I don't know. I don't know. Kinda low key wanna make the pumpkin helmets. Yeah, you know what? Let's just make the, the whole set and let's make this in the bars. Oh, 100 flat. That's what we like to see. Alright, let's, let's put this on. Should I keep the mask on? You guys, you guys let me know. Okay, I'm gonna take this little pool floaty thing off now. I'm gonna... Nah, eh, that could stay on, why not? It's just the necklace and the pool floaty. No, it's just the it's just the pool floaty that's that's making this like not as visible. Okay, sorry pool floaty, but you've had your time. If you're wondering what this is, summons deer clops. We're doing another boss, baby. Boss that we haven't done either, so that's gonna be awesome. Pumpkin armor with a little pumpkin guy. We skinned his family and then we're war we're wearing it. So much of a warrior I am, bro, I swear. How the shoes look? Oh, oh, oh god. Eh, not really great. Okay. Um. Let me just see if I can make normal healing potions, and then we'll go, you know, do the boss. Now, Fonar, remember this boss is actually kind of easy to do? Um. And... I'm pretty sure even if you die, it doesn't like go away. So I mean, that makes makes things a lot easier for all of us here. Let's be honest. Let's just sort that. Okay, why are the chiles right here? But the rest of the fruit—that's that's fruit discrimination, dude. I didn't know there was like fruit discrimination in this game. That's that's sad. Oh well, it's not my problem, I'm dressed as a big pumpkin. <laughs> oh my god, my sprite looks so funny, I run so fast. Um... <clears throat> yeah, anyways, um... Uh, what was I gonna do? Oh, uh... Alchemy, the- oh, well, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Full metal alchemy table. That's right, that's right. Um, here we go. Healing potion. That's a lot of healing potion. And, uh, you know what? Pumpkin pies. I love pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie is goaded, dude. You can't even argue with me because you know I'm right. Pumpkin pies are amazing. So cool. I love pumpkin pies. Okay, well, um, I'm, I'll just fight the boss in the next part of this episode. So I guess now we'll sell. Um, okay, let, how about we'll do this? Can I split? can okay i'm gonna bring one pumpkin pie with me it's eight minutes i doubt the boss is gonna take eight minutes so oh let me just get those lesser healing potions so oh my god i drank the other potion dude are you kidding me
I don't care. I'm just gonna make all of these into normal healing potions. Get it out of the way, you know what I mean? Boom, okay. Um, yeah, so pumpkin pie. I love pumpkin pie. I used to actually be a really big fan of pumpkin pie, but then I kind of fell out of the pumpkin pie wave. Um, but like, dude. Um, for those of you that celebrate Thanksgiving, you know, I do. I mean, usually, usually we have tamales on Thanksgiving in my family. So, I don't really know what that's about. I like having tamales on Christmas. Um, you know, Mexican tradition. But, uh, I don't mind having them on Thanksgiving. That's 33 gold. Let's go to our little piggy bank. With well, speaking of piggy bank, I have a lot of things to tell you about. Um, so yeah, Spider-Man, amazing. I really recommend you get it. I'm probably going to talk about it a lot more. So, um, I went to this retro game shop on Sunday, the most recent Sunday. From when I debuted this. So, the 22nd, October 22nd, 2023, I went to a retro game store, kind of local, not really though, but like still, so I won't, I won't say exactly where it is or what it is, um, because I think it's like only one, it's not a chain, um, but I went to this retro game store, and before I went there, uh, I got every single coin I had from both of my piggy banks. I have a little Kylo Ren piggy bank, probably about... I want to say the size is about... I don't know. Well, it's not like... I'd say like a... A big apple. Like, um... Not, maybe not even an apple. Maybe like... Huh. Okay, it's just a weird size, okay? But I had all the coins in there, and then I have this giant, like, actual, you know, probably a child's head. Like, it could fit on a child's head. It's a, um, Stormtrooper helmet. I like Star Wars, if you couldn't tell. Um, I don't know why I'm going here the long way. I guess just to do something while I talk. Um, but yeah, so I have that. And it's, it was mostly filled with coins, about halfway it was filled. And I did it and I got like 34, 35 bucks, so not bad, but I went to this retro game store. I found Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3 for the PS2, which I have a PS2. And I found Resident Evil 5. Oh uh, yeah, I forgot I was doing that. I want to make that, the, the, the two other houses up here. Yeah, huh, forgot. Okay, well, um, yeah, Resident Evil 5, I got that. Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2, so I got Resident Evil 5 for my Xbox 360. Um, so I got it for $12, and I found the guy had Jet Set Radio for the Dreamcast there. Now, I talked about Jet Set Radio Future, how, like, practically it's just me and my friend, my best friend who knows about it. She knows about it because of me. Also found out my old English teacher from last year knows about Jet Set Radio Future, so that's awesome. Um, what's, what's even more awesome is that where my cursor is, there's a uh, Skeletron cloud in the background. You can see that right there. I like that this game does that. Well, without further ado, I'm gonna spawn the boss. And I'll see you all in the next part, where I will spawn the boss and have the boss fight and stuff. Bye for a couple seconds.